ready to make the magic happen? All right, boys, let's do this. Agua Sampha, Agua Sampha, showtime. Hey, Flash, give me a go, no go for launch. In the pipe, five by five. Word, gotta go talk to the big guy. Hey, little man, what's up? Ooh, any dents? That's why you're a pro, baby. P, sit rep. We're in the green. Deck is cute. First break in six minutes. We are go in five, four, three, two. Moltar. Tom. 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 And Tom. That's a lot of hosts. And tsunamis had a lot of memories. A phenomenal event occurred in the skies which altered the course of human history. It was a legend. There is no hope for our planet if Goku doesn't receive King Kai's training. Meanwhile, Times Square remains in a state of panic and turmoil. This whole planet is going to go any second. It looks like action. Four, Ryan, Larry. Fire the main gun. Yes, sir. Hey, what's happening? Ah! It is your destiny that you hold in your hand. On behalf of the moon, I will punish you. I was suspended somewhere in time and space. All strong, all brave, all heroes. Take heed. Your tampering with nature endangers thousands of lives. Excellent. Takes you back, doesn't it? Back. In case you don't already know, or if you just woke up from a coma, Toonami Jetstream is the place to watch your favorite anime online. Stop on by and check out new shows like The Prince of Tennis, Mare, and Ikaru Nago, or some of your favorites like Pokemon, Samurai Jack, and Satch Bell. Just fire up your computer and enjoy the streaming at video.toonamijetstream.com. Only Toonami and Toonami Jetstream. Been a lot of changes in the Toonami universe over the years. Take a stroll with me down memory lane. Hurtling at unbelievable speed. It's scaring the kids! Dr. Quest will find this a most impressive demonstration. Every weekday at 4, Cartoon Network is building you a better cartoon show. Far out in space, an exploding asteroid sends oh, no. fiery fragments hurtling toward planet Earth. New York is flooding! We call it Toonami. Whoever we're dealing with has a diabolically clever mind. Man will no longer have to think. This whole planet's going up in smoke! As you may have noticed, resistance is futile. A tsunami exclusive premiere. The fate of the entire planet is resting in my hands! Man, this is nuts! And they say you can never go home again. Thank you very much. Check. Flash. Well, it took a while, but I finally got my mitts on Nintendo's new system. It's called the Wii. And when I say hands-on, I mean literally. you got your Wiimote and your Nunchuck. They're the controllers. Now, the Wii's not really about graphics. It's introducing a new way to play games, and it's pretty dope. Starting out, you make your Wii and then set them to play. Out of the box, you get Wii Sports, which is, surprise, a bunch of sports games. Now, even though it comes with the Wii, don't be fooled. It's one of the best games out there. Now, otherwise, the Wii games worth talking about go like this. Rayman Raiden Rabbits is weird and will wear you out, but it's fun and great at Wii parties. It scores an eight. Elephants is Katamari meets Ghostbusters. In a good way, it scores an eight and a half. WarioWare Smooth Moves is more weird Twitch minigames, which on the Wii equals great fun. It gets a nine and a half. Metal Slug Anthology is every single Metal Slug game, all ready for Wii play. It also gets an 8. And the most anticipated game for the Wii? Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. It's way too complicated to go into here, but pick it up for sure. We give it a 9.5. Bottom line, if you're looking for some fun games and don't need the best graphics, grab a Wii and get ready to throw your hands in the air, baby! Ah, uh, ten years. I still remember when I hatched from a pod and took over the absolution. <laughs> I remember Moltar. Keep your eyes peeled. And for those of you who don't, here's a little history lesson. Less talk and more action. We won't be intimidated by criminal threats. Right. Every weekday at 4.
Core, Cartoon Network is building you a better cartoon show. So, I got this weird little game called Mr. Mosquito for the PS2. We call it Toonami. Some of the finest graphics you've ever seen on the PlayStation. Wow. And it's a feeling of freedom that I just can't explain. It doesn't look too sharp, but it plays okay. I can't believe it. May you fight with honor. Honor, honor. Just believe that we came in friendship. Hi, uh, my name's Jason Acuna, but you can call me Wee Man. Tonami gives hot shots called five out of five. Everybody want a 40 inch bicep. I have not yet begun the fight. It's love it. Tony Valdez was a simple man. Tony, you're the best dude! Who didn't want to join the family business. This is all fine for right now. But what about your future? All he really wanted was to be the best skater around. This is what I care about. Until everything in his life fell apart. Now, Tony's lost his parents, his legs. You may never walk again. And his sense of purpose. I was on my way to being a superstar. I give up. But with the help of good friends and even better technology. Somebody stop her? She's putting robots in me? Tony will become the Condor. I could get used to this. Can he stay alive long enough to find out who's behind this evil plot? Avenge the Valdez name and shred the competition. This isn't over. Count on it. Toonami and Stan Lee present The Condor. Next Saturday night at 7. Only Toonami on Cartoon Network. Video on. Blasting through a warp pole in deep space. This is like nothing we've ever seen before. This thing goes off without a hint. Do you have a moment to spare for something very that is all we can do if we want to survive. Created by the great explosion at the beginning of time. Once I pull this lever. Just what we've been waiting for. They're mad! It looks like action. It's coming right for us. It's scaring the kids. Just believe that we came in friendship. Tsunami's turning up the action, cranking up the beatings, and ripping off the dial. Let's do that! Now we're gonna have some fun! Four back-to-back -back Naruto. Shadow Clone Jutsu! Followed by a solid hour of brand new action. Interesting. Great idea! That's six episodes if math ain't your thing. Let's go. It's a Naruto explosion. Next Saturday from 8 to 11, only Toonami on Cartoon Network. It's a web slinging, crime fighting, and a load of this bad guy bashing, beautiful girl saving. You have a knack for getting in trouble. You are amazing. Spidey spectacular. Tsunami showing you Spider Man Saturday at seven, and we're gonna kick the night off with a little treat. The suit. Where'd this come from? A special sneak peek of Spider-Man 3. What's happened to you? I don't know, but I have to stop it. So sit down, relax, and get ready to be tied up Spidey style. Toonami Spidey Spectacular, Saturday at 7. Only Toonami on Cartoon Network. Brought to you by Spider-Man 3 in theaters May 4th. Prepare yourselves. When a routine escort mission turns into the fight of their lives, Naruto and Sasuke must rise to the challenge before rogue ninjas destroy them all. Naruto Uzumaki is here! Tsunami's proud to present the premiere of an all-new one-hour Naruto special. Quite impressive, isn't it? Mission, protect the waterfall village. Next Saturday at 7, only Tsunami on Cartoon Network. The Silver Surfer has come, and Earth's only hope is the Fantastic Four. We're giving you the chance to catch the Silver Surfer and win big. Watch Tsunami Saturday from 7 to 11, spot the Silver Surfer, and get the toll-free number. One lucky grand prize winner scores a trip for four to San Diego and surf lessons. 200 second prize winners get the hookup with Fantastic Four toys from Hasbro. Fantastic Four, Rise of the Silver Surfer, in theaters June 15th. Hang 10, only Tsunami on Cartoon Network. Love to skate? 
Got what it takes? Prove it. Enter the Click Street Skate Competition, powered by Toonami and Cartoon Network. It's going down. 11 cities, nationwide, all summer long. The Toonami Click Street Skate Tour. Step up, compete, and show your skis. For more info, hit up www.toonamiclick.com. Let the good times roll. Get ready to power up, stretch your limits, feel the burn, and lay the smack down. Destroy them. We'll see about that. It's time to be fantastic. Your favorite heroes are back with all new episodes. The Fantastic Four returns Saturday, June 9th at 9.30. It's clobbering time. Only Toonami on Cartoon Network. All set to transform this summer. Bring it on! Well, Toonami's got just the thing for you. Brace yourself! Next Saturday at 7, we're giving you four back-to-back -back episodes of Transformers Cybertron. You still won't defeat me. Try me! All you have to do is sit there on your couch. It's the Transformers Marathon. Next Saturday night from 7 to 9. Roll out! Right! Only Toonami on Cartoon Network. What is this chilling feeling? Toonami's here to free you from boring TV. Well, now we can finally get down to business. We're giving you four hours of Naruto. Eight back-to-back -back episodes. I guess I can handle that. With an hour of newly emancipated action at nine. This kid is something else. It's the Naruto Independence Marathon. Next Saturday from 7 to 11. Party for your right to fight. Only Toonami on Cartoon Network. Well, summer's here, and you know what that means. Good games are few and far between. Luckily, Forza Motorsport 2 for the 360 rolled in, and I'm ready to peel out. It's pretty much the Microsoft version of Gran Turismo, and that's not a bad thing. While Turismo leans a little more toward gearheads, Forza is more accessible to the average gamer and sacrifices nothing for the experts. You can limited slip yourself silly, because this game has all the adrenaline-fueled racing you can handle. With every kind of make and model, from American muscle to Italian race cars. Topped off with aftermarket upgrades, deep customization, and sweet car physics. Plus, the graphics are just insane. Look at that baby shine. So whether you want to plug and play, or see how you can get one more horse under your hood, this racer's the one for you. Tsunami gives Forza Motorsport 2 a 9 out of 10. It takes more than a coat of paint to make it a Thunder Road. Only Toonami on Cartoon Network. Lego Mars Mission and Toonami are teaming up to bring the Red Planet to you. Ten lucky grand prize winners get a trip for four to space camp to play, learn, and explore Mars and beyond. And maybe even figure out how to squash the little green invaders. Runners-up score one or more of these 700 sweet Lego Mars Mission prizes. All you gotta do is watch Toonami this Saturday night at 7 for the toll-free number and your chance to win. Defend the mission and good luck. Get her! Protecting a famous actress seems like a pretty sweet mission. Too bad for Naruto. This on-screen princess doesn't want any part of him. Go bunk someone else. But when a movie set turns into real-life ninja battle, Naruto may be the only one who can save the long-lost princess of the Land of Snow. There is no such thing as a happy ending. Of course there is, if you're willing to fight for it. Can this spoiled girl become the leader her people need? Careful! Or will her evil uncle and his army of snow ninjas destroy them all? It's nothing we can't handle. Tsunami presents the premiere of Naruto the Movie, Ninja Crash in the Land of Snow, September 8th and 7th. Are you ready for your close-up? Only Tsunami on Cartoon Network. I'm more than ready! This is gonna be no sweat all the way! Don't be so impatient. When I say start, you can begin. I must be a potential genius in the making! You don't know what it means to be a ninja. Uh, how can I accept that? Time to train! No one ever said it would be easy. It's no you. Stop being a child and learn how to stand on your own two feet like a shinobi. You're gonna nail this thing today! Take this! What? That was a nice...
nice move to get pulled. True strength comes from more than chakra. Taking you down. You're starting to get the hang of this. Shadow Claw is just so He's stone, and he's a tough cop with an attitude. Oh, Overdrive. Man, that looks like a pretty sweet movie. And that's what Stuntman Ignition for the 360s all about. The movie biz, the stunt biz specifically. You start out as a wet behind the ears driver who's looking for some work. I'm told this is your first time on a big set, so I'll walk you through how it works. And as you progress through the game, you get called in on bigger and better movies, some stunt shows, and a little commercial work. Each movie has multiple scenes with multiple cars, and you get rated based on your performance. You have to pay close attention to your stunt coordinator. He tells you what you need to do. Jump into the tower! And then, you do it. Sounds pretty simple, but it takes a lot of practice and a lot of redos, especially if you're trying for five stars. To score the five rating, you have to link the whole stunt as one continuous trick. Get close to something, pull off a director's requested trick, turn left. hit a time gate, anything. But you can't wait more than a few seconds between each trick, or you won't get full marks. And at the end of each level, you get to watch your skills in action with a trailer for each movie. All in all, it's a pretty fun game. But no going in, you'll probably have to do a scene over and over and over again. Or get to, depending on your outlook. Tsunami gives Stuntman Ignition for the 360 an 8 out of 10. Action. Accelerator. Check. Attack mode. Triclops RC Mutant is on the loose and out of control. Now, Tycho RC and Toonami need your help to control this beast. 200 lucky viewers will win the right to tame the Triclops. If you're good, you could harness its power. And if not, well, it's been nice knowing you. Just watch Toonami this Saturday night from 9 to 11 for the toll-free number and enter for your chance to win. Paint the target and unleash the arsenal. Good luck. Saturday night at 9, Toonami's grabbing hold and shaking some life into you. Two hours of Naruto, One Piece, DBZ, and our collective love. Things are really gonna heat up. Still crazy after all these years. Bring them on! Toonami, Saturday night from 9 to 11. Woohoo! Sounds like fun! Only Toonami on Cartoon Network. Ever want to be powerful or important? He got that right! That's how Shu feels, and he's about to get his wish times a thousand. Because Shu does have power, and he's about to become the most important boy around. Let's get him! With a little help from his shadow, the infamous Blue Dragon. Maybe help isn't the right word. What's going on? Check out Blue Dragon in Toonami tonight at 10. You and your shadow. Don't mess with us! Only on Cartoon Network. Every Saturday night at 9, Toonami's serving up a double dose of Naruto. That's right, two back-to-back -back episodes of the greatest action show on the planet. Yeah, enemy! Yeah! What type of chakra is that? I'm gonna keep coming at you again and again and again! It's all part of Toonami. Saturday night from 9 to 11, live the dream on Cartoon Network. Get out of here. Superman, don't. That's why I'm here. Sometimes the greatest triumphs are born of the greatest tragedies. Even gods must die. Witness the evolution of evil. Never seen Superman take such a pounding. And the fall of the Man of Steel, Superman Doomsday. Premieres next Saturday at 9 p.m. Only on Cartoon Network. It started out as an error. Don't let him get away! But when a new race of super beings attack the shinobi of Hidden Sand Village, Naruto's simple mission becomes something more. To stop all-out war, Tsunami presents an all-new Naruto movie. Stand and fight! Let's go! Naruto the Movie 2. Legend of the Stone of jal -El. Coming up next, only Tsunami on Cartoon Network. Toonami presents the ultimate double feature. First, the most deranged villain in Gotham is back for revenge. Batman Beyond, Return of the Joker. Oh, yeah. 
them. When a race of super beings attack Hidden Sand Village, Naruto must try and stop an all-out war. Stand and fight! Legend of the Stone of jal -El. Let's go! Return of the Joker, followed by an all-new Naruto movie, starting Saturday at 5.30 on Cartoon Network. Well, this is the end, beautiful friends. After more than 11 years, this is Toonami's final broadcast. It's been a lot of fun, and we'd like to thank each and every one of you who've made this journey with us. Toonami wouldn't have been anything without you. Hopefully, we've left you with some good memories. So, until we meet again, stay gold. Swim. I got the results of the test back. I definitely have April Fools. is frustrating. An all-new episode of Bleach, next Saturday night at midnight. Only Tsunami on Adult Swim. Dragon Ball Z is coming up next. <laughs> on Tsunami. If you saw it before Tsunami, you're probably lying. <laughs> Dragon Ball Z. Get all the episodes on DVD now. Dragon Ball Z. And now this is where you have. We'll return in a moment. I've been down with Mass Effect from the jump, so when Mass Effect 3 came out, I was all over it. You can't import your custom Shepard from the first game, which kind of sucks, but you can get him or her pretty close. Oh yeah, look at that sweet mug. The Earth is in trouble and, spoiler alert, you're the only one who can save it. We fight, or we die. Your mission? Get all the different races to join your fight against the Reapers. Seems like maybe the galaxy will finally believe you, but they still take some convincing. Every time you get somebody on board, you're one step closer to survival. We face our enemy together, and together we will defeat them. BioWare put back in some of the RPG stuff they stripped out of Mass Effect 2. Well, it's still pretty basic. But don't worry though, because this game is all about the story. How you deal with people gives you Paragon or Renegade points. I like to use a little of both. Drop me off someplace. Enough! There's a ton of quests, big and small. Keeping track of the smaller ones can be a pain, but overall, this game is great. It looks amazing, sounds kick-ass. If you've played the other ones, your previous choices are sprinkled throughout the story. They don't let you roll with many of your friends from the last games, which is a bummer, but you do get some choices. And most importantly, you still get to hook up. I think if you're saving the galaxy, you should get two or three, but they make you just pick one. But I'm looking forward to talking about something other than business. Admittedly, the ending is weak. They say there's a new ending coming out. But either way, the game's still totally worth playing. Tsunami gives Mass Effect 3 an 8.5 out of 10. Someday, this war's gonna end. Gundam Wing. Do you think that the other Gundams will come? We'll return in a moment. 
best Gundam series ever if you're asking for opinions. Commence operations! Gundam Wing. Pick up the DVDs wherever you can find them today. Tenshi Muyo is coming up next. Dimensional Rift Detected. Dimensional Rift Detected. What in the heck is going on here? On Tsunami. He's got 99 problems. Ah! And these bitches are the main ones. Let's go! Excuse me, ladies! <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Tenshi Muyo. The complete series is available on DVD now. Outlaw Star is coming up next. <laughs> Tsunami. Space. A boy has the right to dream. There are endless possibilities stretched out before you. How do you trust in your own power? Whatever happens from now on, you stand firm and face your destiny without fear, but with courage. What awaits him down the path, he will then have to choose. No one's gonna give you a map. You've gotta walk your own path. The children leave their homes in search of this quest. What is thy desire? As they search, they are always asking questions. What's out there? What's waiting for me? Why was I made? Did they make me for? Are you gonna go up into space with your old man or not? Maybe I'll never get over this. I've lived my life following my dreams, and I don't have any regrets. You gonna just keep running away? Just keep running away? I'm not running. Destroying it. Stand aside! No way! Blue sub number six. Available on DVD now. Trigun is coming up next. On Tsunami. A 60 billion double dollar bounty. Let's go! Badass gunman. And one giant pistol. Dragon, available on DVD now. Astro Boy is coming up next. On Tsunami. Now's a big chance! Go! 
Check out all things Gigantor at Gigantor.org. Now, back to Gigantor. On Tsunami. And we've got an all new lineup. Bleach kicks things off at midnight, followed by Dead Man Wonderland at 12.30. Casher and Sins at 1. Next, it's Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood at 1.30. Ghost in the Shell Standalone Complex Second Gig at 2. And Cowboy Bebop brings us to a close at 2.30. Then we flip the switch and start the whole thing over again at 3 a.m. with a bang. Only Tsunami on Adult Swim. Are you as stoked about it as I am? That's it for Bleach. Oh, right. I recognize... Oh. I just gave you gold. You should be laughing. That was some funny... Dead Man Wonderland is next on Tsunami. In the spirit of rising up from the ashes, we're going to kick off the new Tsunami with a review for a post-apocalyptic Xbox Live game called I Am Alive. It's basically a video game version of the movie The Road. Some sort of catastrophe happened, everything's covered in radioactive dust, and the world is hanging on by a thread. You play a strapping young man who's out to find his wife and kid and get out of Dodge. All you have to work with is what you can scrounge up, and that ain't much. A hunter's bow. Worth a try. You do meet some people out in the wasteland, some who need help. You came for me! Of course, sweetie, I wouldn't leave you here. Then others with just bad news. You made a big mistake! What are you doing here, boy? And you're never too far from being out of everything at the wrong time. So manage your inventory carefully. I Am Alive is far from perfect. It's not super polished and it's pretty short. But this was right up my alley. Tsunami gives I Am Alive an 8 out of 10. This is the way the world ends. Savage mass murder of over two dozen middle school children has led to conviction of 14-year-old Gata Igarashi. I wanna leave! We won't be intimidated by criminal threats. You know the first rule of combat? Shoot them before they shoot you. If it's a fight, you want fun! Why don't we end this once and for all? I don't want to die yet! Are you sure about that? Fire! Every Saturday night at midnight, Adult Swim's building you a better cartoon show. We call it Toonami. All this man knows how to do is destroy. It's the man in red. He's the one you want. Well, look at that. Nothing happened. I thought I'd get blown to pieces. Does a real restraint mean anything to you? Hold it! This endless bloodletting is tearing us all apart. Quite rad, would you agree? Of course you would. Toonami, every Saturday night from midnight to 6 a.m. on Adult Swim. Faithful, time for another night. If you're new to the show, welcome. If you've been down from the beginning, all I can say is thanks. Time to push the button. We humans sure are paranoid about robots taking over. We would never do anything like that. Let her go. Walk away. Who do you think you are? Now watch Casher and Sins, next. They 
say the devil is in the details, but Blizzard says that dude needs an ass whooping. So I picked up Diablo 3 and readied myself for a fight. This one picks up where the last game left off. Just throw it in, fire up one of the five basic classes, and start smacking down bad guys. The game mechanics are simple. Some would say classic. You run around and kill things. Lots of things. There's a huge online component, too. The minions of hell grow stronger. Saddle it up for a more challenging experience. Overall, Diablo 3 takes you on an epic journey from the depths of hell to the gates of heaven. One problem, even if you're just riding solo, you still have to be logged into Battle.net to play. Weak. The bottom line, Blizzard's done it again. This game looks and plays great. Well worth your hard-earned cash. Tsunami gives Diablo 3 an 8.5 out of 10. You are no match for the Lord of Sin. Tell the truth and shame the devil. Only Tsunami on Adult Swim. I know nothing, not even myself. Yet my enemies call me Casher. What could be more beautiful than doing work that puts your soul at risk? Because that's what it means to be alive. There's a whole lot more to it. This whole thing doesn't seem real at all. What is their motive? What is it they're really trying to do? Let's just say my past is catching up to me. What am I, a monster or something worse? Is it really necessary to have a reason to live and fight? You can tell yourself whatever you want, but you've hit your limit and you damn well know it. What does all of this mean, I wonder? I don't know. We need to look at this more closely. No matter what challenges are facing us, it will be all right. I shall become a far more perfect being. Don't let fear get the better of you. No, I get it. has been murdered. The only survivor, Ganta Igarashi. The only recourse that we have is capital punishment. Wrongfully convicted, Ganta has been shipped off to the worst place on Earth, Dead Man Wonderland. One part amusement park, one part maximum security lockdown. This is life, boys. The only way to survive is to fight. Now you'll see him suffer the slings and arrows. But Ganta's got a special talent. He's a dead man. His ticket to fame and glory? A brutal blood sport called Carnival Corpse. The bloodiest, awesomest attraction in the whole park! Only the very strong, or very insane, make it out in one piece. Can Ganta survive this crazy world, or is he just more meat for the grinder? Dead Man Wonderland, Saturday nights at 12.30. Get busy living, or get busy dying. Only Toonami on Adult Swim. Cashier and Sins is over, but Toonami's not. You two are a couple of reckless wretches who cause trouble with every last thing you do. Get out of here right now. Get ready for Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, next. Okay, it's time you and I had a talk about the facts of life. Let's go, right, let's go, right, let's go, right. Reruns suck, but there's no escape. Welcome to the television business. What kind of madness is this? If anybody knows reruns, it's us. Not because we want to do it that way, but sometimes you have to. Not again! You can't make a new cartoon show every day, so you're destined to fall behind and show one more than once. Didn't we see this just yesterday? You will suffer the pain of the thousands of lives you've ruined. Hey, we're sorry about that. I know you guys get burned sometimes. Don't judge us too harshly. You're the worst thing to happen to this world. I mean, after all, we are doing this for you. He's helping to make this country even greater than it already is. Have no fear. Plans are in place to secure the future. I had faith. I knew you could do it. It's a revolution. Tell me some more. It's gonna be a party. Hang out. Keep those eyes open. What could be more beautiful than doing work that puts your soul at risk? That's what it means to be alive. All robots now die. It was my impression that robots can live forever. Not anymore. That is the way of the ruin. Everyone just falls apart. Except for Kasher. 
The ruin doesn't touch him, and even though he caused it, he can't remember why. How could you forget such a thing? So Kashern makes his way forward, looking for answers. Just what am I? I have no idea. There are few humans left. This is all your fault. And most robots want to kill Kashern to survive. I can empower you and I will live forever. The one constant is the wake of bodies he leaves in his path. You don't stop till everything around you is destroyed. Can Kashern find a life of peace? I do not want to fight. Or is he destined to destroy them all? You are a killing machine. Kashern sins. Tonight at 1 a.m. Wake up. Time to die. Only Toonami. Adult Swim. No more Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood for now. I swear these cyborgs are all nuts. Standalone Complex Second Gig is coming up next on Toonami. Normally I beat a game before I give it a review, but every now and then one comes along that's worth talking about that I haven't finished. Catherine! Meet Catherine. It's clunky, it's slow, it's really a pain, and I can't stop playing it. Your character is Vincent. He's haunted by nightmares about commitment, love, and other women. Every night, you face a series of puzzles you have to solve before you die. If you live, you have to choose between two women in your real life. Catherine, your girlfriend, and Catherine, your, well, friend. Just so long as you never think of cheating on me. This game is weird for sure. The puzzles are annoying and difficult, and the mechanics are super cheap. I made it! But when you finish a level, it's so sweet. If you like super frustrating puzzle games like I do, or just want to experience something totally different, give it a whirl. Tsunami gives Catherine a 7 out of 10. Ba ba black sheep. Have you any wool? <laughs> Another standalone complex. What does all of this mean, I wonder? I don't know. playing this game, Slender, it's free. Just find it online and settle in for one of the scariest games you'll ever play. No, seriously. You play as some scared person. The game opens with you alone in the woods at night. You need to find eight pages. Who knows why? As you find them, you'll start being chased by something called the Slender Man. You never actually see him move, but when you look at him, don't look at him! That happens. Slender's a great example of a game that really nails the thing it's trying to do. Every element's designed to slowly ratchet up the tension till you're a nervous wreck. Oh! I've played it a bunch and still haven't beaten it, or even figured out what's going on. You know what? It doesn't even matter. Slender's the scariest game I've ever played. Ah! Toonami doesn't even know what to give Slender. Ah! <clears throat> Here we go again. Standalone Complex Second Gig now continues. Who do you think you are? I'm an impatient woman. A tsunami. So here's the deal. Life doesn't always want to be your friend. Sometimes it'll feel like life wants to hurt you. That was a downer. But you can't just hide. Because nobody likes a quitter. I'll go first. You gotta take chances. This fire isn't gonna stop me! They never said it was gonna be fun or easy. Whether you're totally ready or when you least expect it, doesn't matter. Life will punch you right in the face. Your resistance is futile. Now you can lie there for a second. Cry a little if you need to. But get back on your feet. Because it's the getting back up that counts. That's what shows you've got heart. That's what helps keep you going. Hit me with everything you've got. Fall down seven times, get up eight. I don't wanna go down, not without a fight. No, we'll be right there with you. Wake up, be all that you can be. Only Toonami on Adult Swim. That's all for Standalone Complex Second Gig. Go ahead and run. How far do you think you'll get? You're a bounty hunter. Yeah, that's right. Cowboy Bebop is firing up next on Toonami. Dungeons, dragons, swords, and skill trees. That's what I dream about. Skyrim is amazing. If you haven't played it, stop watching and go get it immediately. For now, let's talk Dawnguard, the first Skyrim expansion. 
When Dawnguard opens, you've got a choice to make. Join the vampires or kill the vampires. I'm a vampire hunter from way back, so that decision made itself, kid. There's a bunch of missions, but much like the main game, there's a ton of other side hustles. There's also a new dragon to find and kill, and it only appears if you're level 78. If you didn't max it before, that could mean some serious level grinding. Good boy, Shadowmere. There's also a few new shouts to learn, and skill trees for werewolves and vampires. Dawnguard isn't great, but it's solid, and it got me back into my sky hole, which is always a good thing. Tsunami gives Skyrim a 100 out of 10, and Dawnguard gets an 8. Skyrim. Prepared for takeoff. Jet is on the job. Well, all good things come to an end. What are you talking about? No, no, no. It's not Tsunami this time. Don't worry. I'm talking about Dead Man Wonderland. We're all out of Dead Man's after tonight. You are the stupidest! But fear not. We got two new shows for you. Wait a second. What'd you just say? Yep, that's right. I said two new shows. You better hang on! Well, new to us. First up is Samurai 7 at 12.30. Akira Kurosawa, Samurai, Giant Robots. What more could you want? Oh, another show, you say? Wish granted. Rika 7's coming in at 1.30. Now we're gonna see something really good. Cute weird girls, more giant robots, and another 7. Get ready for the Lucky 7s. Next Saturday night at 12.30 and 1.30. Everything's coming up sevens. This is so great! Only Tsunami on Adult Swim. And now, back to Cowboy Bebop. Not going easy on you! I thought that was my line. <laughs> on Tsunami. Time for our first revised Tsunami lineup. Get ready. Have I got a treat for you. Bleach kicks things off at midnight, followed by Samurai 7 at 12.30. Gasher and Sin stays at 1 o'clock. Next, it's Aodeca 7 coming in at 1.30. Then, Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood at 2. And Ghost in the Shell is our last show at 2.30. Then at 3 a.m., the whole block kicks back off again. Tsunami, every Saturday night on Adult Swim. Bleach is done with filler and done for tonight. There's more on tap, though. Samurai 7 is coming up next. Summertime's definitely the doldrums for gamers, so I've been snatching up whatever little downloadables I can get my mitts on, like Deadlight for Xbox Live. It's got a lot going for it, but it's got issues too. Deadlight begins with you as an everyman trying to find his wife and kid. Yawn. This is it. This is what's left of our world now. Unfortunately for this dude, the world exploded and there are zombies everywhere, which makes it hard for the family reunion. You know, same old zombie stuff. I better get out of here quick. I really didn't pay much attention to the story. I just focused on a creepy atmosphere and old school science rolling by, which are both great. Unfortunately, the controls aren't tight enough, which means you die a lot. It's also pretty short. We're talking five hours of play max. Basically, if you like zombies and side scrollers, you might dig Deadlight. If that sounds annoying to you, don't bother. Hey, gotta fill these summer days somehow, right? Tsunami gives Deadlight for Xbox Live a 7 out of 10. Dead man walking. Samurai 7 is meditating until next week. It is our duty to accept our fate. Why have you given up? I don't see the point in living if you've accepted your death. Asher and Sins is up next. You know, Bleach has been on a filler arc since we took over. But now that it's back to the real business, it's about time we show this sweet piece of love. Thank you for the compliment. The story arc is insanely huge, so here's the quick lowdown. Ready to do this? Yeah! It's all about Ichigo, a teenager who sees spirits. He kind of screws up early on and is forced to become a soul reaper. They call him Shinigami. Now he has to defend his town from these creepy evil souls called Hollows. Everything in Bleach depends on maintaining the balance of souls, and there are all kinds of players in this crazy game. Let me enlighten you. Let's see, there are the humans. Pretty straightforward. 
the Shinigami or Soul Reapers, and the Aaron Car, maskless hollows that have Shinigami-like powers. Attack now! Anyway, there's too much to explain here, but trust me, it's all gravy. The real battle starts now! Bleach, every Saturday at midnight, on Toonami. That's what I'm talking about! Right where it belongs. No more cash in for tonight. Here goes! Oh, no! The second half of the Lucky Sevens is up next. Eureka Seven. Suck them! They want to kill you, get a cancer, get a problem, get a pollution, get an issue, they don't want to solve it. They want to kill you, get a cancer, how's that make you scared? I should have stayed asleep. Wake it up and get you killed. I'm kite! It's time to hate on haters. Who is this piece of nobody? We've all got one. It's the person who says that sucks, no matter what you're doing. No matter how hard you try, it's useless! Now this isn't the same as criticism. Criticism serves a healthy function. Sometimes it can even help you get better. That's because it comes from a good place. Hating, however, is when someone just wants to cut you down. They want to watch you fall. It's really quite sad. Tsunami's had a lot of criticism and a lot of haters in our time. We welcome the criticism because this is a work in progress and we want to hear what you guys think because we love you. But when it comes to haters, old Tom learned his lesson a while ago. You can't let him get to you. It will take more than that to end my existence. So keep your head up. Keep doing what works for you. And don't be afraid to listen to your critics. But always, always ignore the haters. We all deserve better. Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood is finished for tonight. You self restraint and don't rush into anything recklessly. In moderation. In all things. Check out one of your favorite Ghost in the Shells next. We won't be intimidated by criminal threats. Every Saturday night at midnight, Adult Swim's building you a better cartoon show. All personnel in position, standing by. We call it Tsunami. Ah! We shall show them no mercy. End them at once. That's a lot of destructive power. Oh. You know where that came from? Find cover. It's gonna get too dangerous for you in here. What should I be doing? Get down! We just want to say thanks for being here. We got more in store for you. Let's do this! Trust us. Is that all I am? Monster of death. Sounds all right to me. It is our duty to accept our fate. Tsunami. Every Saturday night from midnight to 6 a.m. Come on, hook in. On Adult Swim. Business time is over. Now, back to business. Who the hell are you, Freako? The standalone complex is back. The midnight run is back. Tsunami's expanding to six straight hours. Whoa. One big shot. I could get used to this. Here's the new rundown. Bleach continues to kick us off at midnight. Excellent. Samurai 7 holds it down at 12.30. Then it's Cashier and Sins at 1. Aodeca 7 at 1.30. You better hang on! And for the first time on Toonami, Symbionic Titan is at 2. I'm out! The Thundercats are back where they belong at 2.30. After that, it's an hour of Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood at 3. 
this, huh? An hour of Ghost in the Shell at four, and our midnight run comes to a close with an hour of Bebop at five. Almost too much to take in, isn't it? That's more Toonami than you can legally handle. This is something special. Toonami, next Saturday from midnight to 6 a.m. Watch it all. We dare you. Come now. Don't be a fan. Only on Adult Swim. Aedeka 7 is done. I have used my hollow matrix to project my human disguise. And what's wrong with your voice? What's wrong with my voice? But give a warm Toonami welcome to Symbionic Titan. Next. Side-scrolling 2D beat-em-ups go way back, like yours truly. So when I saw Dust on the Xbox Arcade, I pressed the Yes button. Dust. You wake up and there's a talking sword with a guardian named Fidget, and the two-button massacre begins. All the scenery and characters are hand-drawn, so it looks like you're playing in a cartoon. Pretty sweet. Help us! You fight your way through the story using chain combos, grabbing goodies along the way. As you learn the ropes, Fidget helps you find treasure. And later on, her special attacks are where it's at. Let's end this. Craft items and upgrade yourself and Fidget to your deadly duo. Plus, you can pick up a few familiar faces along the way. Aww. Loads of side quests, plenty of secret areas to explore, and some really cool extras. Take Dust and Elysian Tail a step above the rest. Tsunami gives it an 8 out of 10. Man, my thumb hurts. For symbiotic tight ancient spirits of evil, transform this decayed form into Mavra, the Eva. Well, the Thundercats are back home next. The kingdom of Thundera lies in ruin. A day I have always feared has arrived, but a small group of warriors has survived. Oh! That's our cue. A lord. Take the sword and become one with it. A rival. You may be king, but I'm still older than you. A cleric. Try and catch me. A soldier. Hold on. It's about to get bumpy. The twins. Yeah. And of course. No. Together they are Thundera's last hope against the immortal Mumra and his lizard army. You cannot comprehend the forces you are dealing with. Just say the word, Lionel. The all-new Thundercats are back on Toonami and better than ever. Thundercats! Oh! Every Saturday night at 2.30. Give me sight beyond sight. Only on Adult Swim. Can't do this alone. You're all dead. Thundercats! Oh! Saturday night at midnight, Adult Swim is building you a better cartoon show. We call it Toonami. Now join us. We've all come here to fight. And this Saturday night, we're taking a look at Fix It Felix Jr. Straight from Wreck and Ralph, rated PG, in theaters November 2nd. Toonami, Saturday night from midnight to 6 a.m. Only on Adult Swim. Thundercats are shutting down. I guess that shows you what a philosopher's stone can do for you, huh? But Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood is coming up next. <laughs> Wreck It Ralph is coming to theaters November 2nd, so we thought we'd check out where it all began. Fix It Felix Jr., the video game. Ralph is the big mean guy who's trying to wreck it. I'm gonna wreck it! And you play Felix Jr. He has one job. To fix it. I can fix it! And that's what you do. It starts out easy, but it actually gets pretty tough. Ah! You've got to dodge all kinds of bricks and debris if you're going to keep on fixing it. You can also pick up what look like pies from the good people of Niceland to gain a little bit of invincibility. Fix It Felix Jr. is an old school throwback in all its glory. So if you're looking for the satisfaction of a job well done, this guy will be right up your alley. Ah! Tsunami gives Fix-It Felix Jr. an 8.5 out of 10. And don't forget to see the world beyond the game when Wreck-It Ralph Rated PG gets to theaters November 2nd. Don't worry, we got a whole nother Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood coming up next. 
You just managed to make new friends everywhere you go. On Toonami. So, what have you guys been up to? Enjoying your time off? <laughs> I know, right? You wouldn't believe the trouble I get into when I'm left to my own devices. So you think people have been asking about me? Oh, yeah. Look, I know you said to keep it between us. But we might have to tell that story one day. Okay, whatever you think is best, bro. Take care of yourself. It's all up to you now. All right, man. Take her easy. Good dude. Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood is all done. Move! Public security! Why do you always have to be so rough? The Ghost in the Shell is coming up next. Every Saturday night at midnight, Adult Swim is building you a better cartoon show. We call it Toonami. Prepare yourself! You sure know how to heat things up. Oh, fight. Three, two, one, fire! And this Saturday night, we're taking a look at Halo 4, rated M for Mature, in stores now. Toonami, Saturday night from midnight to 6 a.m. Try not to get too excited. <laughs> There's a lot more to this case than I ever imagined. This can't be good. We'll take it from here. I've been down with Halo from the beginning. And as a fellow member of the helmeted, woken up from extended sleep club, when I heard Master Chief was back, I enlisted day one. You're awakened by Cortana, and from then on, you're in it neck deep. You start off fighting the Covenant, but soon it's a whole new enemy, the Prometheans. They are a bitch, in the best Halo way. They've got new weapons for the taking. One of the coolest things about them is how they die. As you fight your way through this unknown world, you'll see just how sweet Halo 4 looks and sounds. I won't spoil the story, but once you're done with the campaign, check out Spartan Ops. It's got weekly episodes and new co-op missions. Short version of your to-do list. If it moves, shoot it. And of course, there's the huge multiplayer war games, too. Tsunami gives Halo 4 rated M for Mature a 9 out of 10. Ready to get back to work? I thought you'd never ask. Suda. Who's been here since midnight? They're gonna close up the Stargate. What? This is no joke! The reward is Cowboy Bebop. Next. Tsunami is shuffling the deck and making your Saturday night even better. I think you need a demonstration of what's in store for you. Bleach is still holding it down at midnight. There's an enemy ship approaching, sir. Then Tenchi Muyo GXP reports for duty at 12.30. This is great. Samurai 7 at 1 a.m. We've got company. The Thundercats at 1.30. Well, that's impressive. Symbionic Titan kicks off the robot action at 2. Sword. Shield! Not again! Aedeka 7 keeps it rolling at 2.30. Pick them up! No! Catch an hour of Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood at 3. Let's go! An hour of old school bebop at 4. And we bring it on home with a full hour of Inuyasha at 5. Hot enough for you. Always satisfied, never satisfied. Tsunami, next Saturday night from midnight to 6 a.m. Roger that. Only on Adult Swim. Let's get back to Cowboy Bebop. Hi. <laughs> You're looking for some action? A certain kind of action. I'm all yours. On Toonami. I love shooting things and looting chests. So I've been neck deep in Borderlands 2 for a while now. Just pick a guy and jump right in. Let's get to killing, sweetheart! I like the commando for all-around flexibility, but it's pretty tough to front on a gunslinger. As you level up, you can pick different perks depending on your style, and whether it's the main story or one of the million side quests, you're basically doing the same thing over and over again, but it never gets old. Kill that guy, take his stuff. You can also team up with friends, which makes the enemies harder to beat, but the goodies even sweeter. After you beat it, you unlock the true Vault Hunter mode to play through again for even better gear. There's also some DLC out now and more on the way. No rest for the wicked. So if you like shooting and looting, you pretty much can't go wrong with Borderlands 2. I'm ready for more! Toonami gives it a 9 out of 10. 
They'll save your golf during life. Who's next, huh? That's it for Bleach. The village secret finger jutsu! Ah! A thousand years of death! Naruto returns on Toonami. Next. The prodigal son has returned. Yeah! Don't tell me it's Naruto again. It is Naruto again. Next Saturday at 12.30, Naruto is back. Here we go! And this time... It's uncut. Impossible! That's crazy! We're starting over at the beginning, and you're invited. Oh, I'm very grateful. Because no matter how many times you may have seen Naruto, you've never seen him See? like this. Bring it on. This is gonna be fun. Others are wreck for life, and some of you may go crazy. I'm going to be greater than any of them. Naruto! Naruto, next Saturday at 12.30. I am so there! Believe it. Cut the stupid tracks! Naruto! Only Toonami on Adult Swim. Naruto Uzumaki, it's here! Yeah, believe it! Brace yourselves. Is this what you're looking for? Because Bleach is in recovery mode at midnight. You are the Night Tail Fox. But Naruto is back where he belongs and uncut at 12:30. Here we go, guys. Tenchi Muyo GXP is holding strong at one. What the world is going on here? Followed by the Thundercats at 1:30. Are you just gonna stand there looking pretty, or are you gonna fight? And Samurai Seven at two. Everyone, man your station. Symbionic Titans at 2.30. Then Eureka 7 at 3. Hello there, my cute little lookalike. Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood at 3.30. And it's an hour of Bebop from 4 to 5. And then we close out with an hour of Inuyasha from 5 to 6. Finally, this is starting to get interesting. Tsunami, Saturday nights from midnight to 6 a.m. This day just keeps getting better. On Adult Swim. Naruto's done for tonight. He's rough around the edges, but his misfortune may be the salvation of this galaxy. Shana will make a fine cadet. I greet him with open arms. Join up with Tenchi Muyo GXB next. Well, Bleach is taking a little rest from premieres for a few weeks, but we've got uncut Naruto and plenty more to choose from. And remember, if you squint hard enough, they almost look new. Don't you want to have a little fun? I see finding pirates isn't your only talent. I wasn't even on the air when this gem came out, so I broke out the old PS3 and took off on a journey. There's no setup, just the blowing sands, the haunting melody, and your scarf, Jawa. Getting around is all about collecting magic. By gathering runes and releasing scraps of cloth, grow your scarf longer, which allows you to fly even further. Explore the mesmerizing landscape, always going towards the light. No scores, no lives, no stats, just a zen-like wandering. Ah. Sometimes other random players will drop in. You can help each other out, or just fade them away. There is some sort of story here, but they say life's about the journey, and this one's worth taking. Tsunami gives our first PS3 review a 9 out of 10. Okay, everyone can stop crying now. Tenchi's taking a break from the ladies. I need to power it up. Relax. I'm not gonna break the Book of Omens. I think so. Get ready for the Thundercats. Next. Bleach is in reruns for a few more weeks, but we've got uncut Naruto and five hours of other great shows to take your mind off it. Enjoy. That's it for the Thundercats. Why don't you tell me what the smell of battle is? Oh, sure, of course. 
Uh, blood, grease, swords, you know, some body odor, macho stuff. Sharpen your swords. Samurai 7 is next. All your base are belong to us. <laughs> Aliens have invaded Earth, and it's up to you to stop them. Finally, another XCOM game has arrived. XCOM Enemy Unknown. If you were down before, you'll be super down now. If not, here's the deal. If you're in charge of giving these stinking aliens some serious payback, you build up your squad of soldiers, take them into battle, train them up for the next op, and go fight some more. You meet smarter and stronger aliens the longer you play, which means more trophies to bring back for scientific research. Pro them, boys. Capturing the buggers alive scores even more upgrades. In addition to your soldiers, you've also got to keep the countries of the world happy to keep their money rolling in. So you build satellites, interceptors, and new structures in your base to slow the panic. XCOM isn't very pretty, but if you like turn-based strategy games, you're gonna love this one. Tsunami gives XCOM Enemy Unknown for the 360 an 8 out of 10. We will be watching. Samurai 7's closing down. I like you, kid. I can tell you like things the hard way. I prefer that. But Symbionic Titans get warmed up next. In a distant galaxy, the planet Galaluna lies in ruin. You'll pay for this, I swear it. It's only hope for a future. Forced into exile on a tiny backwater world called Earth. This is to be our new home. Now, a princess, her soldier, and their robot must face the most difficult test of their lives. High school. Salutations. Like every teenager, they've got a secret. Lance, no, not here. But this one's pretty big. When danger threatens, they transform into the mighty symbionic titan that is special. Today, they'll defend Earth as their own. Energize sword. And hope that their people have a future. Symbionic Titan. Every Saturday night at 2 a.m. Armor on. Only Toonami on Adult Swim. They were like giant metal men. Well, where are they now? Salutations, friends. misfortune for believing in something too much. There are times that it's tough to believe in anything at all. Kingdoms rise and fall. Lifetimes come and go. Are any of us here long enough to even make a difference? Undead has fallen! We're in over our heads, okay? What should I be doing? That's something you have to decide. I can't do this alone. Face of maneuvers! There's no time! Okay, hang on. Now don't die! Don't die! And what about Whatever it takes, even if the way ahead lies through a river of blood. Take your best shot. I'll give it back to you a thousandfold. Now you're finally making sense. While we're here, we live to the fullest. Symbiotic Titan's calling in a night. What in the world is Eureka? Just an ordinary girl. Prepare yourselves for Aedeca 7, next. Welcome to 2013, Toonami fans. When I start thinking about everything we've been through together, it makes me kind of... blue. Kingdom come! We 
shall show them no mercy. We're not finished yet! This is no time to be worrying about what people think! Our empire is entering an era of gold. You'd better hold on tight. Now this is the kind of stuff I like. State alchemists also receive a code name. Officially, you will now be known as the Full Metal Alchemist. I like that. So, we're in the home stretch of Leech reruns. Thanks for sticking with us. You're in for a sweet one tonight. Let's get things started with a bang. No more Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood for now. The times have changed. This endless bloodletting is tearing us all apart. Cowboy Bebop is firing up next on Toonami. I wasn't the biggest Far Cry fan, so I was thinking of fading. But after an hour of Far Cry 3, I was hooked. You and your adrenaline junkie friends had dropped out of the sky and into a hell on earth. Did you watch me slice you open like I did your friend? So it's up to you to rescue everybody. That's the main story, but where this game shines is all the side hustles. Hunt different animals to make holsters and bags for more weapons and loot. Unlock new areas by climbing radio towers. Then gain new skills to ink yourself up with your ritualistic tatao. But my favorite part are the takedowns. The graphics are pretty meh. But when this game is clicking, it'll get your heart pounding. There's a couple of co-op missions and not a bad multiplayer mode too. Some people might think it's repetitive, but I'm fully down to spin this hamster wheel. Konami gives Far Cry 3 8.5 out of 10. Who are you? I'm just an old-fashioned cowboy. You're a bounty hunter. Yeah, that's right. Next week, Bleach is back with all new episodes. Finish catching up with this last rerun and stick around for the rest of the night. Don't cost nothing. Point. But what else do you have to do? Stupid dog! My dog thinks you smell like money, and I have the very same impression. Another bebop is next. The wait is almost over. Well, hello there! Bleach is about to make its triumphant return, and Toonami will become whole again. Let's do it. Stark faces down the two visors, Love and Rose. Run and I'll let you live. We don't run. It's time to play. The Espada has tremendous power, but not much heart. Revenge is not my thing. I've had enough. Can he defeat them? Or is this just preparation for an even bigger battle? You're not in the clear yet! Dust off your swords and prepare yourselves for the arrival of... Bleach. New episodes start next Saturday night at midnight. Dying is just the beginning. Man is coming! Only Toonami on Adult Swim. That's all for me, Bob. Ready for some Inuyasha, coming up next. The time has finally come, friends. New episodes of Bleach are back, so settle in. Remember, these buttons don't push themselves. Enjoy. Yasha is back for more. You actually think I hand over the jewel shards as a ransom to get you back? That's what a lover would do! But we ain't lovers! You little vixen, I knew you were giving! On Toonami. Every time I walk through that door, it feels like the first time. Hope you're all feeling it tonight, because this show is gonna kick a little ass. Enjoy. Time for more in 
Inuyasha. In the beginning, each man had his reasons for joining. But no matter the motive, these seven samurai became honor-bound to protect Kana Village. The other samurai, they've come back! Now, they not only fight for the farmers, they fight for themselves. There's no time for pain now! They fight for honor. This is war. Get used to it. And they fight for vengeance. Now, which of us is going to take Ukyo's head? The time of the samurai is ending, and not all will survive the battle. It's not a matter of who dies, but who dies first. But this fight will be long remembered. Witness the beginning of the end. When samurai raise their swords, they don't hesitate to bring them down! Samurai 7, tonight at 1.30. The way of the samurai is in death. None of us should expect to live to see the sunset. Only Toonami on Adult Swim. And now, back to Inuyasha. Nice throw if you're aiming at the rocks. On Toonami. Tonight's the last night of Samurai 7. Hope you enjoyed the ride. Next week, Soul Eater's coming at 1. But tonight, let's celebrate the living. That's it for Naruto. Sorry to interrupt, but I'll be taking your soul now. Get ready for the premiere of Soul Eater, next. Death Weapon Meister Academy. The proving ground for both weapon and Meister. Better get ready, cause we're gonna do it! For Maka, Soul, Black Star, and Tsubaki, the objective is clear. Kill and harvest evil souls. In the name of Lord Death, this evil must be purged. The ultimate goal? Turn each weapon into a death side. Powerful enough for Lord Death himself. When both Weapon and Meister are in perfect resonance, Witch Hunter! there's no stopping them. Are you trying to kill us? But these students are a long way from figuring it all out. Die! In fact, they haven't figured much of anything out. What have you been doing? Please don't ask. Time to hit the books. Get ready for the series premiere of Soul Eater next Saturday at 1 a.m. Eat it. Your soul is mine. Only Toonami on Adult Swim. Our duty as Meisters is to feed our weapons 99 Kishin souls and one witch's soul. We collect evil souls in order to keep the world at peace. We're shuffling the lineup a little bit tonight. Get ready for the premiere of Soul Eater tonight at 1. But right now, it's a new bleach. Enjoy. PSN games have brought me to some strange and wonderful places, and the Unfinished Swan is no exception. You play through the pages of a fairy tale as an orphan who's lost his beloved swan. Hey. By painting this dream world to life, you follow the trail. There it is! It's like an imaginary work of art, and you're the artist. As you progress, new paintbrush modes are revealed that enable you to solve puzzles, find pages from the story, and collect balloons to cash in later for cool extras. Get back here! Oh. The techniques may change, but the aim remains the same. Catch that bird. On the downside, it's pretty short. The ending's kind of dark, but it's hard to put down. Another game that proves you don't need an epic battle to be immersed in a good yarn. Tsunami gives the unfinished swan an 8 out of 10. Here, little Cygnus. Soul Eater's all done for tonight. Drive myself out of a pit. Nearly starved to death wandering the desert to get at you. You think a few visits are gonna keep you safe? The Thundercats are coming up next. Hope you're enjoying the new lineup. What's your favorite part of the next 90 minutes? New Bleach, Uncut Naruto, or a brand new Soul Eater? 
No bad choices here. This is more than a fancy sword. It's the Sword of Omens, and with it, I never lose. We won't be intimidated by criminal threats. Every Saturday night at midnight, Adult Swim's building you a better cartoon show. We're gonna blow you guys away. Well, what do you know, a tough guy? We call it Tsunami. There's nowhere to run! Who's running? Perhaps we should consider our next move cautiously. No time to be worrying about what people think! That's our cue. You were hoping for an explosion? <laughs> this is what I've been waiting for. No more talking! I came all the way here just to say hello. You better hang on! Do your work! You're not gonna scare me away! With pleasure. Here we go! Tsunami, every Saturday night from midnight to 6 a.m. This is a light that destroys us and that guides us all to death. However, it is so beautiful on a dull swim. Shows lined up just for you. Think you can stay up for the whole six hours? Cool. And go. No more Thundercats. Just be down here, let me know when it's over. But there's Symbionic Titan up next. Long time since I played an old-fashioned JRPG, so when I heard about Nino Kuni for the PS3, I dove straight into a Kuni hole. Come now, Dervish Hard. I should mention this game is created by Studio Ghibli, which means it's got that old Miyazaki Takahata feel. Ah. You play as Oliver, the kid on a hero's journey to save his mom. Oh, and rescue two worlds from an all-powerful sorcerer named Shadar. So, no big deal. Come on! Coming! In your corner are a couple of friends and a couple of little guys the game calls familiars. Aww. Ultimately, Nino Kuni is pure old-school RPG. Turn-based combat? Got it. World maps? Check. Dungeons? Of course. There's a whole lot of old-school charm and wonderment. Well, for me, anyway. The only downside? Get ready to grind. And grind. And even if you like grinding, by the end, this game will make you grind. It takes a while to get going, but once it does, it's the closest thing to being inside a Studio Ghibli movie. And that's a pretty magical place. Tsunami gives Nino Kuni for the PS3 a 9 out of 10. Get your Kuni on. It's like a dream, this is. Hey, Nino. Hey, Nino. So what's so special about those watches? Engage symbiotic type. Tonight is daylight saving time, not savings time. But that means we're down an hour. So pour one out for Symbiotic Titan and Aedeka 7.
symbiotic titan shutting down. What do I do? Do I go left or turn right? But A and Echo 7 is starting up next. We ask all citizens for their cooperation during this time. Confirmed, it's an angel. So this one's looking to hit us where we live. Hit it with everything you've got. Japanese government, they're requesting AVA mobilization. We're dealing with a near perfect life form. Conventional weapons won't be of any use. Everyone, brace for direct impact! You expect me to just get in this thing and fight? Is that it? Correct. Center it on the target and then pull the trigger. You're looking at the most advanced weapon system ever developed by man, the synthetic humanoid Evangelion. This is Unit 1, humanity's last hope for survival. Get in, Shinji. All personnel to battle stations, condition 1. There's a chance we could both die on this mission. You won't die. Because I will protect you. Are you ready? Yeah. Launch it! I told you what a real danger. You wanna tell me how that's fair? You can't stop it! Now hurry! Get out of there! Retreat! Shut down! Neon Genesis Evangelion 1.11. You are not alone. Tonight at 1 a.m. We are all in this together. Only Toonami on Adult Swim. Here they come. Everybody ready? Fire! I would sing happy birthday, but we don't have that kind of money. We got K though, and the Evangelion movie 1.11. Right after a new bleach and uncut Naruto. Enjoy. Naruto is calling in a night. The synthetic humanoid Evangelion. This is Unit 1. Shinji Ikari, you will be the pilot. But that's crazy! Well, we've got Evangelion 1.11 coming up next. Tonight, we're back to the regular lineup. So settle in, and let's get things started with a new episode of Bleach. Who's up for the six hour challenge? Hey, Deca 7's finished. We have found you a suitable commission. You'll join the anti pirate decoy squad. Basically, your pirate bait. I'll be the best bait there ever was. Tenshi Luyo GXP is just getting started. Busy few weeks at Toonami. In case you're fuzzy, here's the rundown. I hope you're already sure about to see something incredibly awesome. We start things off with new episodes of Bleach at midnight. Then it's Uncut Naruto at 12:30, followed by our newest edition, Soul Eater at 1. Sorry to interrupt, but I'll be taking your soul now. The Thundercats are at 1:30. Give me sight beyond sight. Symbionic Titans at 2. Aedeka 7's back at 2:30. Yeah, I've been and then it's new episodes of Tenchi Muyo GXP at 3. And Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood at 3.30. I've stumbled into an extra special kind of freak show. We finish things out with an hour of Bebop from 4 to 5. And an hour of Inuyasha from 5 to 6. It's the second best thing you can do by yourself. What are you waiting for? Let's go. Tsunami, Saturday from midnight to 6 a.m. Stay here and watch. On Adult Swim. Cadet Yamada reporting for assignment. Huh? Ready and at your service, Captain Yamada. People often ask me, Tom, does Tsunami actually start on Saturday or Sunday? Because you know, when I stop them and just say, Tsunami starts now. That's all for Tenchi. Why don't you hand it over? Come on, you can't be too surprised. Oh, and... What do you think of that? Full 
Metal Alchemist Brotherhood is coming up next. I've been raiding tombs since tomb raiding began. So when the origin story came out, I couldn't resist. They've made some big changes, but all for the better. Shipwrecked in the Dragon's Triangle, you fight for survival. It isn't an entirely open world, but the island of Yamatai is a platforming playground. And the puzzles are quicker and more satisfying to solve. Biggest news? No more auto-targeting. Making the new combat system the best it's ever been. Finally. Soon your Lara in training starts to earn her badass rep. Hunting and takedown moves are new to the series. And by collecting salvage and artifacts, you can upgrade your stats and equipment. This is critical later in the game, so don't sleep on her. All in all, this franchise reboot hits all the right notes. Lara's back and better than ever. Toonami gives Tomb Raider an 8 out of 10. Cut your luck in. You're an alchemist, are you? All right, then, let's see what you've got. Last year's flown by, but I'm glad we've been back to the regular lineup for a little bit. Hope you're digging too. Who's up for the six hour challenge? The Brotherhood is through for the night. Hello there, my friend. Welcome to hell. An hour of Cowboy Bebop is coming up next. Stroll down the hall and all hell breaks loose. Okay, let's see what we got here. Priority level signal. Oh, that can't be right. Does that what mean? <sighs> Why is there so much interference? The internal booster array should have cleaned all of this up. Well, if you want something done right, you just need to move in a little. Center in. Track 45 right. And everyone's been evacuated. It's time to learn the truth. I could be wrong, but this seems to actually be a scrambled signal from Earth. Let me cook on it a little while longer and let's see what we come up with. This is gonna be fun. What are you, Oblivion? Anyone who has a price on his head knows who you are. It's like a speed Well, it's definitely a recording of some kind. Not sure what. I've isolated a few data points. Check it out. The people you work for lied to you. Who are you? Still got a ways to go. Stick around. That's it for the first Bebop. Ooh. Hey, wait a minute, Ryan. Lucky for you, we got another one. Next. Oblivion is all over this signal, but I don't know what it means. I had to come down to the big screen to blow some of this stuff up. What is this part? Why don't you tell me? I don't you. Have a taste of this. Okay, that's enough, boys. Had to write some new code for the verification software, but I got another chunk clear. They're firing on survivors. The drones will handle it. This is getting good. That's it for Cowboy Bebop. With one stroke, I shall slaughter 100 demons. Got the first of two Inuyashas for you. Next. They won't stop till they find us in this war. Okay, I think I got it all figured out. It's gonna take a lot longer than I thought. I'm gonna need a week. Sorry, guys. See you next Saturday. We got trouble! I'm here for the Tetsaigo. No chance! <laughs> Saturday at midnight, Adult Swim is building you a better cartoon show. We call it Toonami. 
This thing is hot. It's too dangerous to hold on to. This Saturday, we're getting to the bottom of this oblivion mystery. Earth as we know it has been destroyed. Nothing human remains. It's time to learn the truth. Stand down! Or we'll come. Thousands. Trying to kill. This is just the beginning. Tsunami. Saturday night starting at midnight. Yasha is back for more. Let's run. Hmm? What? If the demon is truly big, then we are no match for it. It's irrational. It's impossible. It's against my religion. You ought to be arrested. On Tsunami. Got some big changes coming in a couple of weeks. But let's stay focused on the now. We're starting things off with bleach. And we're not stopping until the sun comes up. Almost done with another sweet night. Care to wait your own Time to put an end to this. So we got more Inuyasha on tap next. So if you missed last week, we ran across some kind of garbled signal. It was coming from Earth, if you can believe that. And I kept hearing oblivion scattered all over it. I've gotten it all cleaned up. And so you're gonna be the first people to ever see this part. Check it out. Survivors. There are four. Check it. Five survivors. They are human. April 19th. Don't want to miss this. Draw your sword, Inuyasha. Let's go! Thanks for tuning in another night. Sorry we got the Thundercats episodes mixed up. Sometimes I really am just pushing buttons. Hmm, what's this one do? for making it through. Put me down. What are you up to? Be quiet. What? Inuyasha? We really gotta work on your people skills. No wonder everyone thinks you're rude. Check out the last bit of Inuyasha right now. are unimaginable. Just look at that go! The track is unforgiving. And the racers are the best in the world. We rule this track. This is the most elite level of the Immortal Grand Prix. Time to play. 
play. For Takashi Jin and the rest of Team Satomi, this is what they've worked for their entire lives. Ready, guys? Let's rock and roll. But now that they've made it to the IG-1, is there any way they can even survive? Get out there and annihilate them. Bring it on. Down yet, kid. It's just getting fun. Get ready for the return of Toonami's first original series, IGPX, next Saturday night at 2. It's a rock Only Toonami on Adult Swim. swim i got the results of the test back i definitely have april fools This is frustrating. An all-new episode of Bleach, next Saturday night at midnight. Only Tsunami on Adult Swim. Dragon Ball Z is coming up next. On Tsunami. You're gonna change the shape of the whole planet! Dragon Ball Z. And now this is where you have. We'll return in a moment. If you saw it before Toonami, you're probably lying. Ah! No, Dragon Ball Z. Get all the episodes on DVD now. Dragon Ball Z. The Earth is gonna blow! Now continues on Toonami. It won't be easy, but I'll try and destroy it. Who would have guessed Gundams had this much power? Mission accepted. Gundam Wing. Do you think that the other Gundams will come? We'll return in a moment. Best Gundam series ever, if you're asking for opinions. Commence operation! Gundam Wing. Pick up the DVDs wherever you can find them today. Gundam Wing. You guys can fight! Well, can't you? Now continues. Tenshi Muyo is coming up next. Dimensional rift detected. Dimensional rift detected. What in the heck is going on here? On Tsunami. I am going to destroy this entire universe. But why? Quickly, there isn't much time. The only thing that is important to me right now is tension. 
there's more tension. Now, it's goodbye. Right after this. Got 99 problems. Ah! And these bitches are the main ones. Let's go! Excuse me, ladies! <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Tenchi Muyo. The complete series is available on DVD now. Tenchi Muyo. <laughs> Roger Smith. Well, that's a first. I'm used to human women saying that. Now continues. Yu Yu Hakusho is coming up next. <laughs> On to Nami. Why do you try so hard? 
Because it's my city, that's why. We'll return in a moment. the world why not start by destroying it Stand aside! No way! blue sub number six available on dvd now now back to blue sub six on tsunami trigun is coming up next How do you plan to get out of this predicament, huh? I don't know. Time to get back to business, Bash. Tsunami will continue. With Trigon. Billion double dollar bounty, badass gunman, and one giant pistol. Dragon, available on DVD now. On the next episode of Bleach, Ichigo and the Soul Reapers need to go after Muramasa, but it looks like that's gonna have to wait. This is frustrating. An all new episode of Bleach, next Saturday night at midnight, only Tsunami on Adult Swim. Now, back to Trigun. On Tsunami. Astro Boy is coming up next. On Tsunami. jump so when mass effect 3 came out i was all over it you can't import your custom shepherd from the first game which kind of sucks but you can get him or her pretty close oh yeah look at that sweet mug the earth is in trouble and spoiler alert you're the only one who can save it we fight or we die 
your mission? Get all the different races to join your fight against the Reapers. Seems like maybe the galaxy will finally believe you, but they still take some convincing. Every time you get somebody on board, you're one step closer to survival. We face our enemy together, and together we will defeat them. BioWare put back in some of the RPG stuff they stripped out of Mass Effect 2, Well, it's still pretty basic. But don't worry though, because this game is all about the story. How you deal with people gives you Paragon or Renegade points. I like to use a little of both. Drop me off someplace. Enough! There's a ton of quests, big and small. Keeping track of the smaller ones can be a pain, but overall, this game is great. It looks amazing, sounds kick-ass. If you've played the other ones, your previous choices are sprinkled throughout the story. They don't let you roll with many of your friends from the last games, which is a bummer, but you do get some choices. And most importantly, you still get to hook up. I think if you're saving the galaxy, you should get two or three, but they make you just pick one. And I'm looking forward to talking about something other than business. Admittedly, the ending is weak. They say there's a new ending coming out. But either way, the game's still totally worth playing. Tsunami gives Mass Effect 3 an 8.5 out of 10. Someday, this war's gonna end. running away? I'm not running. Your own destiny. Don't fear failure. 